I'm gonna have to start this video. Hello everyone, I'm Wait, back. So we are at Coco Head Hike again. Um, I wanted to come back to this because this is now after they finished the renovation. So they have redone all the tracks to make it more safe for everybody. Oh my God, we're gonna see how long we take to do this, but my cousin and I, we're gonna try and do it as fast as we can to see sunset at the top. So what they have done to renovate the trail is they had some gravel they added so that it's not as crazy unstable and this dirt, but they put more planks down so that when you're going up and you stand on the sides, you have more space to stand and it's more stable. Um, and then they just went all the way up with that. So when I last made a video, last time I made the video, it was halfway done. So this time it's completely done and we'll see how we do. We are almost halfway to the top. I think the bridge is halfway, but cardio is not happening today. Just waiting for me. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. I can almost see it. It's right there. It's a little dog. We're not letting it pass us. You see it? No way. No way. We made it. Now we're going to the top top. My cardio is so bad. We just like see each other. It's really calm and relaxing today. No breeze. It's pretty breezy usually. Hey guys, so I have realized that this is the end of the video and I did not do a closing again. Um, but yeah, that's the end of the video. Um, Coco Head is pretty much the same at the top. They haven't really changed a lot on the, the upper part where you can stand on the platform and everything. But just the stairs have been renovated so far. Um, it's a lot more spaces you can wait on the sides just so you can have relaxed time and not be in people's way if you want to sit there for a long period of time. Um, and also the steps are very consistent in size so you don't have to worry as much about, you know, your knees getting real heavy impact going down at the end. Um, it does get a little bit of a bigger gap between the steps going up just because it's getting steeper. So keep that in mind. Um, you can also just 
do this hike in slippers. I saw a couple doing it with slippers, but like shoes probably is ideal because you want some cushion when you're going down for your feet. Um, yeah, so that's about it. Um, bring a lot of water. Make sure you're hydrated before because this one will test you. <laughs> um, yeah, this time I was not ready for it the hike because usually I go in sunrise and this one was pretty much three o'clock and so we were trying to three or four o'clock trying to get it before the sun set and well actually it was six o'clock because the sun set late um yeah so we were just trying to make sure to get there before sunset the sunset is pretty nice you see it over the mountains so you're not gonna actually see the sunset but it's worth it up there just make sure if you don't go down before the light gets dark you're gonna be hiking in the dark so bring um a flashlight or something um yeah so that's gonna be the end of the video like and subscribe and also if you want to see other places that you're curious about or just want to see how it is please leave it in the comments or message me yeah on instagram or something um i will try to do those videos if you guys really want to see those um and I'll just do an honest review of the places I go and just my experience. Um, yeah, trying to get back into the, what's it called? The schedule of twice a month, the first and third Sundays. We shall see. But if not, I'll see you when I see you and see you on the next one. Bye.